Today we're going to be playing a game called Siberia the World Before. If you guys don't know what this game is all about, they actually have, I believe, three other games leading up to this one, and this is just their newest one. I had played the um, other three on my Switch, um, but I just figured, hey, we'll just get into it. It's new. I'll play this for you guys. But basically, we are playing as this woman, and she used to be like this reporter, and she'd have to go and travel to report some uh, stuff for the big bosses that she worked for. Uh, she eventually quit, and now I guess she is just uh, on uh, travels, you know, exploring, uh, being a little detective-ish, uh, doing some puzzles, helping out people, uh, just different things like that. So hopefully you guys are into it like I am. Make sure you drop a like if you are. Let me know down below in the comments section if you'd like to see more, if you end up enjoying it. And make sure you subscribe and don't forget to turn on post notifications. All right. Wagen Musician District. Spring 1937, a young woman runs through the streets of Wagen. I don't know if I'm saying that right. <laughs> Her name is Dana Rose. You know, honestly, we might even be playing as a new person. I don't even know if they're like continuing with the same lady as before, but I guess I'll end up seeing, so... Living memory of Benoit Sakal. Oh, and everything is like kind of like steampunkish, so a lot of this stuff is run by a lot of machines instead of actual people. But the graphics are really beautiful. <gasps> a game by. Wait, did he pass away? Oh my goodness. What? The man who created the game? No way. That's insane. Okay, so yeah, I'm guessing we're playing as, um, I think that's who Dana Rose is. See, that's a whole different character from what I had played as in the other Siberia games, but should be interesting. We might get into some danger, some quite adventurous moments, you never know. Also, I don't know if I have to put subtitles on. I don't know if this is all gonna be in rush. No, I don't know. I don't know if it's in a different language, but we'll see. I need to hurry. Okay. Carl Beckman said she will be waiting for me on the square at the top of the main street. Big day today. Herr Baumgartner's bakery. I usually love the place. Everybody does at the academy. But today I'm much too nervous to eat a strudel. Hurry along to the square. You don't want to be late. Not today of all days. Oh, this is German. No? That's German. So if you guys are into these types of games, this is more like a point and click type of puzzle, like I, I just said, story type of game, and uh... Looks like everyone left in a hurry. Oh my goodness, they must all be waiting for me on the square. Goodness, girl. Chop chop, pork chop. Come on, girl. Come on, Twinkle Toes. 
Okay. I know how to run now. All right, secondary objectives. Throughout the adventure, you will sometimes be given secondary objectives. There is no obligation for you to accomplish these objectives, but if you do, they will lead you to interesting additional content and background information. Be aware that active secondary objectives will be canceled if you progress throughout the story before accomplishing them. So stay alert and do not hesitate to get off the beaten tracks. Cool. I love games like that. That's awesome. All right. Oh, I have to hold it. Okay. So. That's all right. I think we'll just focus on the main storyline and uh, maybe after this video, maybe I can always go back and have some fun after. Maybe we could talk to him. Go on, hop it. Don't want your sort of hanging around here. Wow, toxic. The National Socialist Party of Ostertal. I think that's what Papa calls the Brown Shadow. Nothing but yobs in uniform, according to him. I'd better not hang around here. Shoo. Heck nah. Come on, Twinkle Toes, let's go. She can't run up that. Good grief. Guten Tag, Frau Beckmann. Ah, oh, Frau Line Rose, there you are. You're perfectly on time. Thank you, Frau Beckmann. Suffice to say, I expected nothing less. May I have your convocation notice? Wait, oh, I don't even have it, do I? Keep your sheet music for the concert. <clears throat> it's your convocation notice I need. Where do I get that? Sorry, girl. I don't have Oh, wait. Yeah, I do. Hold up. That gives me arrow options. Okay. Thank you, Fraulein Rose. Now, remember, performing at the annual spring concert is a great honor and rewards the best Music Academy student of the year. So it is imperative that you show yourself worthy. I will do my best, Frau Beckmann. The piano is ready. Oh, the piano. Make this day yours, Dana Rose. I've always wanted to learn how to play the piano. It's so beautiful, so pretty. Dang, she looks nervous. Girl, just get up there, play your heart out. You know you're good. She's like, there's so many people. <laughs> Can't do it. Sage fright. Ah. <laughs> okay, look around. You can change the orientation of the camera by holding. Okay. Got it. Get the piano ready. Dog, what? What is this? It'll be all right. It'll be all right, Dana. You'll not make any mistakes, and they will come out of the tower. That's cool. Come on, play something then. Oh, good grief. I'd better get started quickly. Ah, <sighs> Huh. Everyone's waiting. Oh, goodness. We got some impatient people. This icon is displayed when you can manipulate the selected object, select marker. Okay, okay, okay. Got it, got it, got it. Everything's ready. Okay. All I need to do now is arrange my sheet music and begin. Alright. Uh, okay. We have a cute little book, alright. Cool. 
simple. the violin okay dang you're playing that music music it's a cool thing about the, these types of games uh for siberia is that it's like so old school but futuristic at the same time i don't know how to explain it but it's just uh it's really neat all the inventions that they have in, in these games it's pretty cool Oh, standing ovation! Yes! The crowd is going wild. <gasps> Dang, that girl jumping around! She's so cute! This is the day that she got over her feet. Majestic is that? Oh my goodness. Yo, these graphics, I can't even get over it. These graphics are really cool. I love games that are just like movies. It's just it's so awesome. It's a movie that you can actually play. All right, so where is this? A salt mine? The iron, I, iron taiga, taiga. Oh yeah. Okay. So what's happening? This is a completely different scene. What is this? Girls, you good? It looks cold. So we have a diary. You can consult your diary to get a reminder of previous events. The diary also gives you access to your objectives and to the documents. Okay. Cool, cool. Alright, so... <gasps> okay, interesting. Okay. So, Seeking Kate Walker. Okay. Mrs. Olivia Foster. So Kate Walker, by the way, is the woman in the previous Siberia games. Um, I have no clue who these two people are, though. Uh, Mrs. Olivia Foster, Lexington Avenue. I guess that's where she resides. 
Okay, uh, we have not had the pleasure of meeting. My name is Nick Canton, a private detective. So Nick Canton was actually um, kind of over uh, Kate Walker, the Kate Walker situation. Uh, a few years back, I was asked by the law firm Marston and Lermont to find Miss Kate Walker and bring her back to the United States. As you will know, she is wanted by the police for alleged misappropriation of funds. So, yeah. Which is true. Okay. The pursuit of your friend has been hectic to say the least. Indeed, I fear it has affected my mental health. I ended up being the victim of a serious accident and now find myself in the Valsenbar Clinic where I am convalescing. What is that you can say? Convalescing? <laughs> does it mean convulsing? <laughs> no. <laughs> what the heck? Um, this is where the parcel you sent to Kate Walker landed up. Your address was written on the back of the envelope. Okay. All right. I am given to believe that Miss Walker was among your closest friends, which is why I'm writing to you. I should explain that I am no longer mandated by anyone to find the young lady. However, I must admit I am still keen to carry on with my mission. My sole objective being to try to warn Miss Walker about all the trouble she keeps getting herself into and if possible to persuade her to come home. Where are you, Miss Walker? All right, so there's a lot to catch up on. All right, just different notes back and forth with Nick, Canton, and Mrs. Foster. Um, so they told me that despite the sacrifice of Oscar, the automaton, to protect her, she was taken prisoner by a dangerous local fascist militia. After almost a year of laborious investigation, this trail has allowed me to localize Miss Walker with near certitude. Okay, I think this is going through all of the stuff that I played. So basically all the past games is what I am getting at. Yeah. Oh, okay. She's detained in a salt mine. This mine is, in reality, a labor camp owned by a consortium of mobsters and neo-Nazis in search of uh, vestiges of past grandeur and of their nation. I have just arrived in the region. As I expected, the mine guards refused to hand Miss Walker over to me. They even pushed back my attempts to bribe them a bit on the light side. Though, I must admit, due to the deplorable finances, the guards nonetheless assured me that she was well. For some reason, they burst out laughing on mentioning her close relationship with her cellmate and the way in which the two young women protected each other. Oh, so this is probably Kate Walker now. Okay. So, Simona Kal Kalanina? Okay. All right. So, maybe this is Simona in here? I'm trying to figure out. Okay. I'll talk to you in a second. Pushkin's poem. All right. In the depth of the Siberian mines, keep your proud patience in the depth of the Siberian mines. Your sorrowful labor and great ambitions of your thoughts will not be wasted. Okay, yada, yada, yada. Alexander. Okay. Okay, now we can serve it. Guitar pick. Okay. What a beast, bro. All right. Okay. <laughs> okay. Sleep okay? Like a bear. Yeah, I heard. Better get ready, Katusha. Mm, I feel like I've been run over by a tank. <laughs> you okay? Sure. Digging in a salt mine 12 hours a day in the hope of finding a fragment of ivory? Couldn't be better. Don't let it get to you. 
Maybe I'm a fool, Kate. Oh, wait, Maybe I this should is have Kate? listened to my folks. If I had stayed in line in the National Choir like a good little pawn instead of forming an anti-establishment punk group, I would not be here now. I'm glad I've got you, though. Listen, Katusha. We're going to get out of here, right? Yeah, right. If you say so. Yeah, I'm just gonna say, Kay Walker looks so much different in the previous games. Like, she had long hair, she, she was like, yeah, she did not look anywhere like this. Um, that's wild. Today's the day we're supposed to take over from Team Orange in Gallery C, right? Don't remind me. They say it's really tough. Isolated with no rescue party on hand. Which is crazy, because it's the worst gallery for cave-ins. We should get going, Katusha. I mean, what if the guard catches us slacking off when we should be ready? Who, Simona? She's no altar girl, but she's not the worst around here. True. But I will be ready in time to leave. I just want to get all the rest I can. Come on, Katusha. Better get ready. Sure. Okay. Five minutes, no more. Da? Da. Alright, get ready for work. Okay. Um... I better freshen up first and see how cut you she is. I'll pick up my gear after. Didn't we already see how she was doing? <laughs> So I guess basically they just keep them as prisoners so they can just work in the vines. That's crazy. Better not forget your good luck charm. I don't think I've ever seen you without it. It's all I got left. Oh man. So Oscar was um, this robot, which they call automatons. And he basically was like taking her on all of her journeys, um, but he ended up um, sacrificing himself and dying in one of the games, so I guess that's what she has left of Oscar is she kept his heart. So, dang, that's crazy. All right, let's, let's look at it. There's all Oscar's data inside. I was lucky enough to steal it from the militia soldier who picked it up at the frontier between Baranur and the Yakast. I just need to find a compatible body for it. That is, if I ever get out of here. God, another day of hard labor. What are you gonna do now, Kate? Jeez, can't believe it's been almost a year since the militia sent me here. Gotta get out, move on. Whatever that might be. But how, though? No news from outside, nothing. Does anyone hmm. even know I'm here? Probably not. <laughs> for Christ's sake, someone must be looking for me, mustn't they? Mustn't they? All right, I guess. Don't worry. Uh, I'll be ready by the time Simona turns up. Hmm. Oh. 
Can I not look at anything else? Stay close, Katusha, okay? Team Blue! Hey, you've got mail. It's for you, Americanska. Thanks. No stalling you here. You got five minutes to see what's inside. Or else, a less friendly face will come to get you. Toxic! Wait a minute. Is that the same bird from that one thing? This melody stuck with me throughout my childhood. I remember even my mother. It belonged to my mother. I used to play with it when I was a kid. What a plane ticket. Hmm. Okay. Olivia Foster, New York. What could she have sent me given our dispute after my leaving with Hans? Strange. What? August 23rd, 2003. Dear Kate, wherever you are now, Despite the sad news it contains, I hope this letter reaches you in time for you to make preparations to return to New York. Your mother, Sarah Walker, passed away last night no. in Mount Sinai Hospital. She had been doing poorly for several months and her death was no doubt a release. Wow. The funeral will take place Thursday, next week. We pushed back the ceremony so you can be with us. If I'm not mistaken, returning to the United States means you run the risk of having to answer to the law. Hmm. Sometimes it's better to pay your debts to society instead of being forever on the run. And for once, just put aside those senseless, adventurous pretensions of yours. They've already cost you your friends and family. I beg you, Kate, please come back and say goodbye to your mother. Call me so we can organize your return in the best conditions possible. Dang. I've enclosed your mother's pendant. According to her, you used to love the mystery of its melody. I promised her I would send it to you. Call me for the sake of what's left of our friendship. Olivia, 212-359-1519. Oh, man. All right, here we are. I guess we're playing back. I guess we're going to be playing as both um, Dana well, and done, Escape. Dana, dear. I'm so proud of your concert on the square at the Academy of Music. We shall find a pretty frame for your diploma. Thank you, Mother. Once you've finished your studies at the Academy of Music next year, you'll be able to start higher education at the Paris Conservatory. Won't she, Anton? Of course. Of course. Then, my darling, you'll become a great concert pianist. You make us so proud, doesn't she, Anton? Of course. Of course. So <laughs> proud. I really do want to become a concert pianist, but the thought of leaving Papa, you, and the house to go to the Paris Conservatory doesn't exactly thrill me. And it's perhaps not such a bad idea for you to move away from Wagen. Times are hard at the moment for people like us. I think I did say it right. 
I do worry about your health still. Thankfully, Herr Gustav agreed to take you on at the Mountain Refuge this summer. Oh, yes. The mountain air will do you a world of good, my dear. By the way, did you write to Herr Gustav to thank him? Oh, uh, well, I was very busy rehearsing the concert, you know. The gentleman is offering you a job, Dana. Thanking him is the very least you can do. Yes, Mother, I'll do it right away. All right, no, new notes were added to my diary. Open up the diary. Concert went like a dream. <laughs> oh man, she was so nervous about it too. Alright, this is a note to Anton. Alright. I ought to put these away before I lose them. I'm pretty sure I know this piece by heart now, anyway. The Hymn of Wagen, my favorite concerto. Hmm. Maybe I could use it to write my letter to Herr Gustav. Okay. It's in the side drawer. Hmm. Come on, girl. I guess I can't get through that, so let's just go ahead and look through this. Still trying to figure things out. Dana, oh. darling, I hope you're not seriously thinking of writing a letter to your future employer with that old pencil. <laughs> Come on, Herr Gustav, my future employer. Thanks to this summer job, I'll be able to help Papa pay for another year of schooling at the music academy. The diploma Frau Beckmann gave me after my concert on the musical square. Mama was so proud. A lot of empty picture frames, huh? I guess that's what they do. They do framing for stuff. Makes sense. Okay. We need to figure out a way to get in at this one. It's stuck. Papa really ought to tidy up. Okay, then I guess maybe not? Hmm. I ought to write that letter before I go up to my room. Dana Puppet, I'm busy right now. Dang, Dad. I'm about to leave and you just gonna treat me like that? Papa, could your pen be around here somewhere? Could be, I suppose. Papa is so untidy. <laughs> uh, oh, here you go. Papa's pen. Perfect. Papa is so untidy. Dang, how many times are you going to say that? Four Alberg automatons. These machines are incredible. These were all very interesting readings, but I should get back to writing the letter now, or Mama will get cross. <laughs> so how dare you? Dana, darling. I hope you won't see. Four 
normal or friendly? Well, obviously, for working for him. Herr Renner, I would like to thank you Piss for. Over here, you don't, 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 Anna! It's too dangerous. Oh my! What in the name of? Oh my goodness! How rude! Is it that one dude that told us to bug off earlier? Dana, darling, no, no, give it to me, please. Oh my goodness. What does it say, Father? It's nothing, Dana. Nothing but spite. Will they ever leave us in peace? Come on, Lena, my dear. Hey, come on. Look at me. Don't let it get you down. Huh? Or we'll both end up in Paris with Dana. <laughs> Why are you acting like that's a bad thing? Oh my gosh. Why would anyone do that? Why take it out on us without reason? Lena, please. Hmm. Ooh, we about to read this thing. Piss off out of here, you filthy vagarians. Horrible. They really do mean business, don't they? Oh man. Alright, here we are at the salt mine again. I think it's kind of cool, like, we get to switch off between characters too, and I guess at some point they'll probably meet in the middle and cross paths. Maybe? So, so far, if you guys are enjoying it, make sure you go ahead and smack up that like button for me. What do you think of the graphics, though? The graphics are pretty cool. Like I said earlier, it's like Kate. a movie. It's so cinematic. Come on. We need to get to work now. Nah, you can do it. <laughs> Should we ignore it? <laughs> we should ignore it. <laughs> Kate, please. They'll beat you up if Simona finds you like this. Kate, stop this. You can't change the past. Now come to work before you get us both killed. That's it. I'll get started working now. You push the cart closer and come dig next to me, okay? I'm very sorry, love. But we'll have all night long to cry. So insensitive. Like, come on. Do the work for her. All right, where is my stick Kate, at? please. Stick. <laughs> oh, man. Where's my pickaxe? Let me farm up some ass real quick. Maybe we about to get some brick. An ivory fragment. The guards grant benefits to anyone who finds any. But I couldn't give a damn now. Shit, girl. Shit, ain't that serious. Brakes are on. <laughs> what a surprise. So you can be with us. Ever on the run. 
Now if you push it, no, we gotta push it all the way over here. She's kind of slow, no? You weren't there. She kind of slow. No, Granted, it is probably really heavy. August twenty third, two thousand three. I can't imagine just like being trapped in like salt mines and like have your parent or guardian like pass away like that or just like a loved one in general you're just like in a different country I can't imagine that How this was bringing everything kind of scary. You broke her heart. You deserted her. You can't be so hard on yourself, though. She died asking for you. Sorry, I didn't see. Hey, look! Come on, let's go and see. <gasps> oh, are they gonna be able to That's escape? Our ticket out of here. <gasps> yeah. Let's check it out. You got it. Oh my god. So you're gonna need a key. Okay. Secret eye, bruh. Where did they come from? Oh, must be something to do with the train. Never mind. I didn't even notice that, to be honest. <laughs> Yo, how did I not see that? Oh, come on, we already did that. Where did they come from? Must be something to do with the train. Right. Deep. Can't even see the bottom. Yeah. And it means the tunnel on the other side is cut off. Must be the way out. I can see the light at the end. How do we get across that? I'm sure there's a way. Follow me. Just climb the train. Might be a little risky though. Alright, direct character control. You can hold down the left click and move your mouse in order to take direct control of your character. Isn't that what we've been doing? 
Oh, I see, I see. Like that. Like turn around, but a blue bop. Let's go back here and look at some stuff, honestly. We might find a key for that lock. We might be able to find some handy stuff. Okay, come! I need a hand over here! Oh my goodness, I'm trying to explore. Come back over here. If we build up enough speed, we should be able to use the height difference on the edge of the precipice as a takeoff ramp to get to the tunnel on the other side, and then get to the surface. Sure, that is if you can get the thing started. Don't worry about that. Back in the days with my band, I always used to repair our old van on tours. Okay, but wait a second. First, I want to take a closer look at these bodies and maybe figure out what happened here. Hmm. Looks like Second World War uniforms. They belong to the Brown Shadow, the fascists who triggered the war before they herded up and massacred millions of innocent people. They were hmm. shot in the back. Full tank of gas. And it looks as if they were headed for the exit tunnel. It's like they were ready to head out. Looks like they were in a hurry, judging from their position. I wonder how a bunch of World War II fascist soldiers ended up here. Right. And who killed them just as they were about to ride out of here? One thing's for sure, though. We've got to give this motorbike a try. <laughs> what, what happened to them? What happened to this train? Jump over the ravine? Exactly. But the keys aren't on the bodies. I checked. They must be somewhere inside the train. You go and find the keys while I take a look at this motor. Will do. You'll be okay? Don't worry, love. I'm sure this beauty and I, we're going to become best friends. I mean, honestly, if she would have just let me do what I was going to do and try to find the key, I feel like I just wasted my time over there. This carriage is more luxurious than the other ones. Maybe a dignitaries? Ooh la la. All right. Oh, that's nice. We love hints. But we don't need them. I mean, basically, I mean, they give us hints with having things highlighted. Another body. Right? Great. Hmm. I don't think I can make any use of that. Oh my goodness, yo. Oh. Nothing interesting here. Alright. That must be the shooter. Smart. One last drink to work up some courage. All right. Now this one is back in 1944. I will be nothing more than a sack of bones by the time you, whoever you are, read this letter. Every day I have learned to be ever faithful to the fatherland and carry out my duty in the name of our illustrious leader. I will not have wanted it any other way. As per my orders, we have managed to accomplish our mission of securing the train in the agreed place of refuge hidden away from the enemy hands. Okay. So what about the motorbike? They were planning to try to escape on the motorbike and then run into the enemy to reveal the whereabouts of the train. <gasps> so there were spies. 
Ooh, betrayal and dishonor. Mm -mm -mm. I have hidden the. Uh, I have hidden the ignition key as a matter of form. Okay. So where do you hide it? Major Christian Sotza. So this brown shadow officer shot his own men and then killed himself to make sure the train was never found by the Allies. Wow. Whatever it holds must be priceless. Hmm. Let's search somewhere else. Nothing interesting here. Okay, so she doesn't care about any of those papers. What in the world? What kind of doohickey is that? Oh, secret compartment. Brown shadow emblem. The distinctive symbol of the brown shadow fascists. Many countries have banned it. That's just fine by me. Hmm. Interesting. Wonder why we needed that. Okay. No key. Where did he hide it? More bodies. Looks like they were shot dead while they were eating. Dang, so he killed more than two people? He went on a rampage. Dang, bro. Alright. Well, I mean, the key's gotta be in the cart somewhere, right? Okay, let's search the train for the keys. I can get into the carriage over there. We probably have to go back, right? Yep. That must be the way out. At the end of that tunnel there. Right, okay. So we do have to go back in there. Maybe, can we search his pocket, maybe? Go girl, go girl, hey, hey. Oh wait, I could have ran with her this whole entire time, right? No, 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 no. Enter. Go back. The thing is, nothing else is highlighted in here except for this desk. Didn't let me ins inspect that. First, kind of weird. Did it? I don't remember seeing that. Oh, that's smart. Hidden compartment. Hmm. Oh, okay. Two. Oh, one for the motorbike, and then one of the keys ah. is still covered in blood. Ew. Must be the one for the motorbike. Ooh, that's nasty. Right. We'll go give that to her and we'll see what happens. Are we, I mean, are we just gonna escape like that? Damn. 
It hasn't been started for too long. But leave me to it, and I'll see if I can get it going. If I can just get it to kick start, we might be home free. Ah, oh, she can do it. <laughs> okay, I'll leave you to it then. I'm gonna go search the train a little more. Maybe I'll find something useful for when we get out of here. Sure. Yeah, I was about to say, where's the other key? Other key? The yep. Bingo! Ding, ding, ding! Do this. Oh, that's cool. I just had to move my mouse in a circle. Interesting. Click, 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 click. That's so annoying. Yeah, I need to invest in like a. If there's a silenced mouse out there, if any of you guys know of one, like comment down that below. Cause um, your girl would love one that makes no noise. Okay, your chariot's waiting. Hey, what are you? <gasps> Holy crap! Wow, look at all this, this treasure. Is worth a fortune. I can't believe it. This is going to come in nicely when we're on the road, babe. Dang. It must be priceless. Now I understand why the brown shadow wanted to hide the train so badly. There's a veritable fortune in loot here. A masterpiece. The brown shadow must have loaded it during World War II. Okay. I don't think we can even take any of it. What is it? It's incredible. You gotta see this. <gasps> Wait. Hold up. Yeah, it's pretty well done. I like the color of the Isn't rock that? face there. Is that what fascinates you? No, Kate. There, look, it's right under your nose. Not. It dates from 1937, That's apparently, weird. but I can't make out the signature. Cola? Coba or something like that? Anyway, what's so fascinating about it? You mean you can't see? Take a closer look. Sorry, you'll have to be more specific, Katusha, because I still can't see. Look again, there. The girl. She's your spitting image. Well, what? I don't see it to be honest. Sorry, but I still can't see the resemblance. Come on, you gotta admit it's incredible, right? Either way, I suggest you put it away. We'd better get going. All right. 
Come on, kid. You gotta admit she looks like you. It must be a sign. Hold it right there, Wait gosh. a minute. Oh, no. All right. You've caught us. But take a look inside this carriage. The train is full of treasure. We could all escape with, with tons of it. Just she probably just wants look. to leave too. Don't move. Listen to me, Simona. You've always been good to us. So why can't we help each other now? We'll be stronger together. <laughs> sure. You've been nice little prisoners. I have nothing against you personally. But why can't I keep the treasure for myself? Ooh. I could leave this rotten prison. You can Nobody still leave know. it. I could even say you tried to escape, which wouldn't be a lie. But Simona, don't. Don't take it personally. I just need a change of life. I think you can understand where I'm coming from. No! Oh my. Oh. Well, you know, if you guys want a part two, let me know, because, you know, I'll be more than glad to give that to you guys if you wanted it. Um, so comment part two down below in the comment section, and I guess we'll see what happens for the rest of My Kate Walker's picture. journey. Oh, Kate. Poor Kate. Dang. Now you're on your own. <laughs> With a train full of treasure. <laughs> It'll be all right. Not really. It'll be all right, Katusha. No. Not for me. Hush, Katusha. Listen. That girl in the picture it would have been so cool to go looking for her together, wouldn't it? Nothing's changed. I'm still taking you with. No. You. You. You gotta go. You gotta go, and find out before the guards come. Find that girl. All right. Kate, love you. Remember me, Kate. I'll close my eyes now. Oh, man. All right, well, that's going to be it for this part of the video. Again, let me know if you want a part two. Comment part two down below. That was crazy. But hopefully you guys liked it so far, hopefully you liked the graphics, just like the whole overall um, vibe of the game. It's, uh, it's just pretty chill and pretty cool. So I will see you guys in the next video or the stream. And until next time.